it's an electric conversion so basically a Toyota Soluna old one it's got a solar roof on the top So today we are going to see uh, a Thai EV engineer. EV stands for electric vehicle. So basically it's a guy that converts cars. He puts in, he takes out the gas engine, watch it, and puts um, electric motors in it. That's it. Let's see what he does. I'm going there now. It's about 30 kilometers away from me. The reason why I want to meet him is I have my Toyota Yaris at home, right? It's an unfinished EV project, EV conversion, and hopefully this guy can help me finish it and maybe get some other ideas. So, the guy is not here, I'm um, gonna have to wait for him, call him up a bit. And this is the car he built. It's an electric conversion. It's a basically a Toyota Soluna, old one. It's got a solar roof on the top nice i need to tell him that he has to clean it if he wants the highest efficiency on that cool and yeah it's a electric conversion car cool well done man looks solid oh much harder suspension probably because of the extra weight of the batteries all right guys uh we are here and yes camera yes so we are here, we're going to try this car out, go for a little test drive, see what happens. So it's basically a Toyota. It's just a Toyota with a manual gear shift. Yep. That's it? Clutch? Okay. Gear one. And then? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Same like normal car, right? Okay. Do I change? Okay, so it's like a normal car. <laughs> it's got a little bit electric sound. The little whiz of the electric motor. Uh huh. So it's 72 volts. Okay. 72. Otherwise, everything else is just like a Toyota. Yeah. And you have a regen, regenerative braking. You know, regen, right? And then charge the battery. No, no have. Uh, generation one. Yes, generation. Generation two, uh, my free energy. Yes. This one uh, don't have? Uh, I make free energy. Free energy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cannot uh, charge. Cannot. Uh, oh, really? Uh, generation, uh, uh, generation two. Oh, nice. Free energy, yeah. Uh? Good idea, good. <laughs> yes, yeah, very good. So he, if for you guys that un understand what he said, he says he made a car on free energy, yeah. so you don't have to charge it. Yeah. Very cool. And the solar panel, uh, how much electricity do you make uh, to power this? Uh, one, one, uh, one the the solar, uh, yeah, charge bed, how light? Uh, Uh-huh, uh -huh. in one day, shall we? Yes. Yes. Oh, nice. So, 72 volt battery. Uh, how many amp hour? Yeah, how many uh, kilowatt is the battery? Kilowatt. Uh, 15. 15 kilowatt. Okay, okay. Very nice. And how much horsepower is the motor? 60 horsepower okay that's not too bad very very nice it's very quiet 
you know it's perfect no fuel <laughs> it's very nice zero fuel oh no power steer <laughs> uh, you know. and that's it and turn off turn off Doop. okay let's see what else we got I'm wearing the helmet it's funny <laughs> all right see what is in the engine battery yeah big battery man <laughs> 150 M yes yes That's the charger. 20 amp. Hey, 20 amp. Very good, nah. Hmm. Uh, most the product in Thailand? No, no, no. This is not Thailand? No, 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 Thailand. This one? China. China, China? All China. Okay. And this is the controller. Yeah. Yeah, motor there. That's it. And any Kenya? Oh, more batteries. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and converter. Solar. Converter. Solar. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, chai, chai. Yeah. And uh, air air conditioning pump. Uh, air conditioning pump. Yes. You have a pump, right? Yes. Ah, oh, see, not same. Yeah. Ah, oh, okay, 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 okay. Very cool. Okay, so I talked to the guy when we stopped. I wanted to know uh, how many kilometers he gets out of this. And he gets about 100 kilometers, which is not bad. You think about the big batteries here. And he says all the batteries together, these three here and those three in the front, are a total of 300 kilograms oh my god that's really heavy yeah and so he gets about 100 kilometers range out of that and top speed of 85 kilometers per hour because it's a small motor you know so uh, i'm gonna try his little motorbike over there let's see the little motorbike he built uh, it's very simple design he uses a lot of lead acid batteries because they're simpler design right so all this here and the motor over there it looks like a tiny little motor i'm gonna try it out no clutch no gear okay let's try not too heavy not heavy at all nice okay how do we turn it on aha uh -huh. cc pad volt 48 volt yeah yes yeah and um, that's it yeah not bad it's got a little kick to it but at 48 volt oh shit there's no brake <laughs> yeah it's not it's not very fast my bicycle <laughs> is faster than this i'm going 40 yeah, this is not a high-speed machine. And it's got the terrible brakes. <laughs> yeah. So it's just 48 volts, so the top speed would be around theoretical 45, I presume, without even asking. Because that's how voltage works with electric. I would say the motor is um, maybe a thousand watts due to all the weight of the batteries. That's why it's so slow. Yeah, so going about 40 kilometers per hour here. Yeah, that's it. To remove the uh, original gears of the bike. And there's no regenerative braking, neither on the car or on this bike. So, yeah, it kind of coasts. You gotta use the brake a lot. Nice, well done to ride. It's a chain drive.